So today I just went to Walmart, picked picked this up. The set number for this is seven nine zero two six. No, wait, seven six zero two nine. Sorry, I was reading it upside down. And I've been kind of wanting it for a while because, like, I tried to paint a Mark Forty Five, but this comes with real Mark Forty Five. So, and at the end, I'm gonna do a review to tell you what I think. building it I want to do the review so the mini the first the only good guy minifigure that you get is the Iron Man Mark 45 from what I can tell I would think that it's way better than my painted one and then I've got the Ultron thingamadoo where you can do this hold that guy up like that so all the actual Ultron minifigures are actually sort of destroyed, and you have to pull their parts off of the actual thing and assemble them. So, for instance, you go like that. He's built. Stick him together. You've got this guy. And then you pull these legs out. Put him on this guy. You, this guy actually looks kind of weird. They do actually have a new clear piece for holding onto the back instead of the normal, like, dark gray one. Which, and this I actually like better. As far as playability features, we've got the super jumper, which can do this. the best with aiming, but, well, let's see if I can hit all of them with one shot. Oh, okay, I'm gonna have to take this guy's backpack thing off. Okay, still shoot her down. Okay, let's see if I can do this. Yeah, I forgot. I have to pull his legs off. And this is an annoying part. 
every now and then it'll get it'll get really hard to put that on. And to actually hold this guy in place, you have this little piece right here that goes right down. On, that part goes right down on top of his backpack thing to sort of like hold him in place, which is pretty nice because otherwise he'd just be rolling everywhere. And actually, for Iron Man, you also have these light clear blue bricks that can attach like that, and then you turn his hands upside down and attach a stud, like with these guys, only theirs aren't upside down, so it looks like he's flying, because he's Iron Man. Hey. As far as extra pieces go, these are not extra pieces, by the way, you've got an extra stud shooter launcher, a lot of dark blue studs, one of these, and a little robotic arm. So just let me put this whole thing back together. Wait, does this guy go on the side? I think he does. No, he doesn't. Go on the side. I think one of my favorite part is, parts is about when you're looking from the back, these don't really look like legs, they look more like little boosters. This is mine. I would recommend people to buy it if they have a total of $13 at Wal for Walmart, but it's not exactly the biggest set ever. Thanks for watching. Please like, comment, and subscribe. Bye!